<clears throat> so this is where I wait for my cool downs. Do you know, I haven't attempted Mage Tower in such a long time. I'm actually a bit rusty because I haven't been play playing WoW well for a bit. I could never get... Well, I think I, I could get past the next stage. Um, but then I would really struggle to get my 8 healed without letting like loads through. So that by the time you get on stage 4, <clears throat> when he becomes active... I just get overwhelmed by all the ads again. It's ridiculous. So, fingers crossed, I can do it this time. Because, like, you know, my, my gear is, is pretty much way over the threshold for the Mage Tower, which is quite embarrassing, actually. Um, I managed to do, I think I was like three, not three, uh, 920 something when I did the protection Mage Tower. I completed that. So, I've done that twice. Once on this paladin, uh, which is Horde, and then once on my Alliance paladin. Um, I've also done the, what was it? The Feral Druid skin, Mage Tower, twice, again, Alliance and Horde. And though, that was absolute face roll. I did it with, I think I had like 905 item level. Um, and it, I did it like on my second go. It was so easy in comparison. So, ideally, I'd love to get all my Mage Tower skins because, like, you know, I'm a completionist. They're being removed for BFA, which is, like, a month away. Um, but I, I'm not holding out much hope. I haven't actually attempted the Rhett one yet. I've majorly slacked. Um, but fingers crossed I can get that done. But I don't want to do it until I've completed the Holy One. Which I don't know whether is a good tactic or not, but um, yeah, and then I want to attempt like all my other characters as well, because as you all know, I've got like one of every class at max level on Alliance, and then I've got um, additional max levels on Horde. I think I've got my Paladin, my Druid, and a Priest. Um, but yeah, I'd like to have them all for the sake of saying, yeah, I've done them all. But with a month to go, I think I've left it so late. I, I just couldn't. Fr I just got so angry at Mage Tower because I failed so much on my Holy Paladin for this challenge that it just put me off attempting the Mage Tower. I was sort of resigned, thinking, no, it's fine. I've got my blue kitty skin. That's what I wanted blue fire kitty. Um, I can live without all the rest. And now I'm like, mm, can I? Can I really not at least attempt them? So. Here I am, <laughs> glutton for punishment, trying them again. <clears throat> I don't have the best legendaries on this character. I've got um, the Sephir's Secret Ring, which is um, one of the recommended rings for this challenge because there's so much CC that is involved in the earlier stages. Obviously, the haste buff is amazing. Um, I've then got a crappy... Well, I say it's crappy. It's not crappy. Uh, Soul of the High Lord. It's an okay legendary because obviously it gives me an additional talent. Um, so instead of just having Holy Avenger, I get Divine Purpose as well, which is pretty cool because it procs a lot. So that saves me um, Holy Power, and obviously it increases my my heal th uh, my heal throughput whatever. So like, you know, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> But with an item level of 961, and I've been a raid healer since TBC, I should be face rolling this, but I just, I, I don't know, I just can't get, I cannot heal the three people quick enough, and I think my problem is targeting, I, I struggle to target them, maybe I should make a macro, for like targeting, I don't know, it's too late now. Tends to start off that these are the two that require my beacon, the warrior and the rogue. So we'll see.
but they're not demons. No kind of knows. Great. That's all I need. That's where I struggle. See, I've just let two three, uh, two through even. <sighs> so struggle, I really do. If I didn't have to heal my party, I'd be fine. I'd face roll it. Let three through already. I don't know, I just panic. I just need two more. Come on, thank you. <laughs> so how many did it get through? It was like five got through. I know I can do it, I just panic. Well, one good thing is that I didn't get any archers, so it should be doable. It should be fine. from my lay on hands I've pretty much got everything off cooldown down so it's cool. right now I probably should have watched the video to refresh my memory from this bit don't heal me I'm gonna kill that oh I nearly didn't Shit's going down.
second attempt back today the first time in like i don't know what two months oh my god i'm so chuffed i'm so glad i actually came and did it today i was like oh do i do it i almost didn't oh my god i'm so so chuffed right let's go and get the weapon um i don't do you know what my heart was going to the dozen Dad. yes darling I think I just woke her up. Damn it. She was asleep. Whoops. Yes, darling? Mummy's fighting demons. She's probably thinking, yeah, okay. Because I know what that is. Although she probably does. Oh, there's a go over here. Oh, I'm so jealous. Raise a weapon. Woo -woo. Hang on, darling. I did it. Can't be the fucker up, though. Whoops. Hang on. I'm hoping I'm hoping there's a purple skin of that. I think there is. And I think there's also a blue version as well. Right, so all I've got left to do on my paladin now is ret. Um, which I will attempt later. So yeah. I can't believe I've only done it. I'm so I'm actually so chuffed, I don't know what to say. You have no idea how much I've attempted this and I'm quite embarrassed by that actually. because um, like, you know, this being a healer for the past 12 years like raid healing as well um this really challenged me more than it probably should have and i think it was my nerves who were getting the better of me um because i was getting overwhelmed and things and panicking rather than just thinking just do it it's fine <laughs> i don't know how i managed to do that last bit but i'm so chuffed right, thank you guys i will see you next time bye